All right, welcome back. Walking and running are some of the most popular ways to get moving and stay active, but you need the right equipment. Shoes. Irene <laughs> O'Connor is live at Kelly's Place in Old Mystic Village on this Mystic Monday oh. to show us how to get on the right foot. Hey, Irene, how are you? Kelly's, Kelly's Place. Place. Hey. Pace. Kelly's oh, it's Kelly's Pace. Pace. We're here at Kelly's Pace in Old Mystic Village. And I know you guys find this hard to believe, but I'm officially trading in my heels today for some running shoes. Uh, that's kind of hard to believe, but we're with Jeff Anderson, the owner of Kelly's Pace in Old Mystic Village. It's a gorgeous day to run or walk. Yeah, you know, we should be outside running. It's so nice out. The sun's out. It's clear. It's a great day for running. Yeah. Uh, you know, tell me a little bit about, you know, when you're talking about a beginner runner or an advanced runner, how important is the right pair of shoes? It's so important because most people don't even know their sneaker size. Your shoe size might be one thing, but your running shoe size can be totally different. And we want to make sure that the shoe fits the person correctly, which means a little bit of looseness to it. But also we look at your gait and what your structure is and find a shoe that will match up to one, your foot type, your body type, but also what your goal is, whether it's walking, running or racing. Right. And that will really pay off in comfort, right? Totally. Comfort is so important because you want to enjoy your sport, whatever it is. Right. So it seems like running shoes are really getting very cushioning. They are. Like, this here is the Ghost Max, which is a lot of cushioning. They're all getting cushioned with a good support on the bottom, a nice soft upper. They've gotten rid of all the overlays. So it's all about comfort, fit, and style. All right. You've owned this store, you said, for about eight years. Is that right? Ten years, actually. Oh, ten yeah. years. Excuse me. Ten years in time beautiful... It, time flies, exactly. In beautiful old Mystic Village. And it's called Kelly's Pace because of John Kelly. Right. John Kelly won the 1957 Boston Marathon, and he and his wife started the store 45 years ago in this location. That's amazing. That's amazing. So if somebody walks in and they say, look, I've never run before, what's the most important piece of advice you could give them? One is if they're starting to run, take it easy and go slow and build up your mileage. Uh, two is get a good pair of running shoes. And here would fit you would look at your length, arch height, arch width, um, your body mechanics, then bring out two or three or four different shoes to try and go from there. Right. Um, I'm going to be fitted live on air for a new pair of running shoes that's coming up in our next half hour. But John, thank you so much for being with us. Oh, you're welcome. And I mean, this is like exciting because it's, it's really exciting because the weather has turned into a great running you know season right. you're like you're training for a race this is really racing season in the fall yeah so we've got you know socks shoes clothing uh accessories and apparel and um nutrition to help you out all right we are live at kelly's pace if the shoe fits you got to wear it guys back to you all right thanks irene we appreciate that very much i wish that you could have seen him irene he I ran away in the studio after we tossed to you I and i didn't running through the studio yeah. at kelly's pace i thought you were heading down to mystic for I, 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 I could Kelly's have in the time that you know I was like just running 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 he got up and just started breaking it where'd you go Scott